Good morning. All right. Thank you and welcome to the second annual California Day of Preparedness. This is a very important day when we try to show all of our young people about all the things you need to do to be prepared for disasters. Do you live near an area that can flood? Do you live near an area that can have a, a big fire? Do you near, live near an earthquake fault? Those are things that can happen to your home. You need to be prepared. What does the sign up here say? Be smart. Be responsible, be prepared, and what? And get ready. Get ready. And get ready. <laughs> Tell your parents that you want to prepare a disaster kit. And in that kit, you want to put all the things you need to survive for three whole days. I want you to have a disaster preparedness plan, a family plan. You should talk to your family about all the things you're going to do in case you need to respond to a disaster. Today, I'm honored to have two very important people here with me today. First Lady Maria Shriver. Also, a very good friend, Mayor Jerry Brown. This is the 30th anniversary of the California Conservation Corps. This is a group of young men and women that are protecting our state, that are getting prepared, serving the environment, and serving the larger purpose of making our whole community better. And the whole goal of this campaign is that we all work together. When I became First Lady, people said to me, California is not disaster ready. We don't have enough blood, enough people don't donate blood, enough people don't know what to do. So for the last uh, two and a half years, we've had this campaign across the state to educate people about what they can do to help themselves and help their neighbors, which helps their community, which helps their state. I'm so thrilled to see so many kids and so many people who are volunteering to help. These are all, you know, moms, dads, men, women who take time out so that if there is a disaster, they can be the first people on the scene. California is on its way uh, to becoming one of the best prepared states in the country. We have great search and rescue teams. We have great uh, CERT volunteers, great firefighters, police officers. But most of all, I think we have great citizens. 